My ice string biscuits are a fun take on a classic party food and they're really easy to make. So I'm going to start by creaming the unsalted butter and then I'm going to add some caster sugar to that. And these need to be creamed together until they are light and fluffy. As you incorporate more air into the butter and sugar, it turns paler, and that's how you know that the mixture is ready. So you can see that the mixture is paler in colour and really light and fluffy. So now we're going to add the egg and vanilla extract. So break one egg straight into the bowl, and then just a small splash of vanilla extract, and then beat to combine. Now the egg is mixed in, it's time to add the dry ingredients. We're going to mix them together in a bowl first. So I've got a plain flour, half a teaspoon of baking powder, and then a pinch of salt. Then I'm going to add all the dry ingredients into my egg and butter mixture, and then turn it on gently so the flour doesn't splash everywhere. You're looking for it to come together into a nice soft dough. So I'm going to wrap the dough in cling film and place it into the fridge to chill for 30 minutes so it will be easier to roll out. So now the dough has been chilled, it will feel really firm and it will be a lot easier to roll out. So I've got two pieces of baking parchment, which is what I'm going to use to roll my dough in between. It stops it from sticking to the surface and stops you having to flour everything. Pop it in between the baking parchment layers. And I'm going to roll it out until it's about half a centimetre in thickness. So I'm going to peel back top layer of parchment and I've got a round cutter which I'm going to use to cut nice even rounds out of my dough. If it gets a bit sticky you can just lightly flour the cutter. I use the lid of a vanilla extract bottle just to take the centre out of each biscuit. So you want to move the cut out biscuits onto a baking tray using a palette knife. I'll pop the middles out. So I've got 12 biscuits on one baking tray. I've got this remaining dough that you can either put in the fridge and use later or carry on rolling and make some more biscuits. But for now I'm going to put these into the oven for 10 to 12 minutes. Once baked, the biscuits should be golden but not too brown and then leave them to cool completely before decorating. To decorate the biscuits, I've mixed up three different kinds of royal icing. One purple, one yellow and one pink. So I'm going to take one of the biscuits and then dip it face down into one of the colours. So I'm going to go for yellow first. So you want to dip one biscuit in, lift it out and wait for the excess to just drip off. Give it a shake to even it out and place it onto a baking tray. Then take one of your piping bags and drizzle a line across the biscuit. And then use a toothpick to make a feathered line up and down the biscuit. You can use any colours of icing, get creative with decorating these biscuits. 